A Russian airstrike hit a large military base in western Ukraine on Sunday, extending the conflict into new areas. At least 35 people died and more than 130 were wounded, according to regional governor Maxim Kozitsky. He said Russian planes fired around 30 rockets at the facility, but some were intercepted. Reuters was unable to verify his statement. Britain said the incident at the extensive Yavoriv base, just 15 miles from the border with NATO member Poland, marked a significant escalation. It also heightens fears that Russia's invasion of Ukraine could spill over into neighboring NATO member states. US President Joe Biden has previously said NATO would defend every inch of its territory if that happened. Intensive Russian attacks have been reported around the country. In Cherniv, around 100 miles northeast of Kyiv, firefighters rescued residents from a burning building after heavy shelling, verified video from Ukraine's emergency services showed. Moscow denies targeting civilians. Ukraine also reported renewed airstrikes on an airport in the west and attacks on the southern town of Mykolaiv, where officials said nine people were killed. Ukraine's human rights monitor said Russia used phosphorus bombs in an overnight attack on the town of Propazna in the eastern Luhansk region. Reuters has not verified those reports. In the southern port city of Kherson, more than 400 people were detained by Russia's National Guard as they protested against Russia's occupation of the area, according to Ukraine's military high command. Despite the violence, both Russia and Ukraine said they thought progress could be made at peace talks, 18 days after Moscow launched what it calls a special military operation. A Ukrainian delegate said Russia was beginning to, quote, talk constructively and results were possible in a matter of days. A Russian delegate also said they'd made significant progress.